I'm Colonel Dr. Dari, orthopedic surgeon with special interest in uh, arthroscopy, that is minimally invasive keyhole surgery of the joints. We have a young man, a 22 year old, a footballer by profession who sustained an injury to his right knee while playing football. Uh, he injured uh, one of the main stabilizers of the knee, we call it the anterior cruciate ligament. This is an injury that is uh, very common in sports and it occurs when there's contact or when there's a sudden twist of the knee in which you get a sharp snap and thereafter the knee becomes completely unstable. So we have examined him and today we have prepared him for surgery or reconstruction of a new ligament. We are going to show you some of the tests that are commonly, commonly done to confirm that the patient has sustained a, an anterior cruciate ligament injury. This test is called a Latchman's test. At about 30 degrees of knee flexion, we fix our arm, we fix the femur, and then you can appreciate this extended translation of the lower bone, that is a tibia, this is a classical sign of a torn anterior cruciate ligament. We complement this test with uh, an MRI to see what other structures may be damaging the knee that may not be obvious to us using these clinical signs. Okay, this has been a successful surgery comprising of uh, meniscus repair. Uh, this patient had a medium meniscus tear which you have successfully repaired with a, a technique we call inside out meniscus repair. And we follow this with the reconstruction of the ACL anterior cruciate ligament. We have used the graft from a tendon called semi-tendinosus tendon and augmented it with a fiber tape from Atrex company. So we know that's a very good construct. It's basically what you call internal bracing of the structure. So it should be firm enough and uh, strong enough for this patient. This uh, patient, once he's fully healed, to be able to go back to his active life, which is football.